Good morning, Don Lane, Fraser Valley News, your morning news update for this Tuesday, May the 9th. BC Lions fans, this is a really sad day, especially if you're old like me or, or older. Joe Cap quarterbacked the very first Grey Cup winner for the BC Lions way back when, 64, I believe it was. Joe Cap has passed away at the age of 85. So yeah, diehard football fans, we, uh, we're not taking this one, well, we're not taking this one too well, so... Yeah. Let's go, Lions. Let's go. Okay. Uh, on the go. Uh, we have uh, Andrew McGrath, who is now on the Cultus Lake Park Board uh, for uh, Bylaw Compliance and Enforcement Officer. That was named yesterday. Canada Day celebrations for Abbotsford are now well underway. They are looking for talent. All you have to do is go to the City of Abbotsford website and uh, you know, click on there for more information on how to become one of those people that uh, will perform on Canada Day. We're keeping an eye on the weather for obvious reasons, as this heat dome, and a lot of people are calling it that, are on the way. Uh, coming up on Thursday's edition of Chill TV and Abbey TV's News of the Week, we're going to talk to Professor Emeritus at UFV, Dr. Tim Cooper, um, when, we're, when it comes to what is a weather event versus climate change. A lot of people get tripped up on that. If there's something we should know about, let us know. F-E-N at Shaw.ca. Have yourself a good one. 19 today. Going to get warmer by the end of the week. Don Lane, Fraser Valley News.